Oh, that's a lovely ball in behind. Jada, Salah, he buries it. The flag stays down for the minute, my friends. Golazo Mohamed Salah. If this stands, what a goal. What a goal, and it will all come down to the timing of Jada's run, but the finish from Mo was a molazzo of the highest order. Unbelievable finish from Mo there. No fucking about. Top bins, and we all just wait and see if he's on or off, and it will be down to Jada's. Let's have a look. Oh, I think he's off. I think he's just off, you know. What a finish, though, after that. Oh, I think he's just off, lads. Oh, I don't know. Oh, please be on, lads. Deserves a goal, that does. It's great bit of play. Are we in? Ooh. Yep, goal stands. 1-0. Take that, you cheating shower of scum. 1-0. Whoop, whoop. Congratulations, by the way. We had a payout. Paul, you earned 33 quid. The first payout of the day. Congratulations to you. And let me change that scoreboard. 1-0 to the Reds. What a start. We'll take that. Great goal by Mo. Just a great goal all around, to be fair. Second ball's won by Stones. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Come on, boys. Go on, Mo. Oh, Mo. Should have done better. Salah was through. Left-hand side. Grealish shows good recovery pace to get back on him. And all Salah has to do is roll the ball across the 18-yard box to Jota, who's in space. And he can't get the ball through. That's a really good opportunity wasted there to go 2-0 up on the counter. Mares cuts inside. Oh, I'm not liking this. Gundawan. Fuck off. One all. It's a good goal in fairness, but carved open too easily. It's a good goal. They moved the ball quickly. Got an overlap on the left-hand side. Pulled it back across. And he was there for a tap-in. And again, a lot of our hard work undone early doors. Look at the space out on Trent's side again. After that, it's just a good delivery from Grealish. Again, it's that overlap I keep telling you they try to create on the other side. It's an exquisite ball across from Grealish, and it's a good finish. But again, that overlap on the right-hand side. And these are the margins. As I was saying a minute ago, with Salah's ball across the Jota, we could have been 2-0 up. But nope, we're pegged back, and it's 1-1. Ball in behind here from City. Oh, shit, we're in trouble. 2-1. Oh, Fuck. Knew we were in trouble the minute that ball was played across the pitch. One minute into the second half. Klopp can't believe it, look. City win the ball. And then look at the space here. Look at the space that Robbo leaves them in. After that, it's just Alisson should have got a hand on it. Robbo left too much space and Alisson should have got a hand to it. Fuck's sake. That, that, we should have been able to deal with that. But we didn't. And it's 2-1 City. And again, all that hard work of going 1-0 up away. Come back to haunt us. All the instructions Klopp gave at half time doesn't last 90 seconds. Robbo comes back inside to try play the offside trap and in doing so does himself dirty and gives them the space. And then Van Dijk not tracking De Bruyne either. That's just nonsense there. Robbo was coming back to try and play the offside trap and in doing so he did himself dirty like. And that's what gave him the space and then Allison should have got a hand to the ball across and Van Dijk should have been tracking De Bruyne. But either way, it's another soft goal. It's just so frustrating, isn't it? Alvarez. Gundogan. Fuck off. It's, it's bullshit defending. The state of it. Just allowing them to have shots and nobody closing down. Nobody getting a block in. Nobody throwing their fucking body on the line. What are you standing around looking like a fucking idiot, Van Dijk? Oh, oh, put your fucking body on the line and get a block in, you absolute twats. Fuck me. So easy again. Couldn't be arsed closing down. Couldn't be arsed getting a block in. It's all about standing there and looking cool and not defending, right, Verge? Get a fucking block in. The state of it. Look, nothing there from Fabinho. Trent blocks his shot and then no one's there. Gundogan's just left alone. Van Dijk standing nowhere near to play again. Just waving his arms around. Fuck off. That's just... That's just appalling defending again. Standing there like a bunch of fucking clowns. Nobody. Fabinho didn't even get a close him down. Didn't throw his body on the line. Didn't try and block it. Did nothing. Just allowed him to get a shot away again. Way too easy. Way too easy. Ten minutes. That's all it's taken for us to throw away a point. Klopp, I'll just get Darwin on now. Come on, just get him on. 
Might as well lose the game 4-0 or 4-1 as 2-1 or 3-1. Just go for it. What is up? Like Van Dyke and Canade between them couldn't lead a fucking... I'm not going to say what I'm going to say there because I'll be cancelled, but... It's just it's just pathetic. It's like they're just too obsessed about looking cool and not getting dirty and getting down and doing the hard yards. It's just it's getting pathetic, our defence, at this point. Do we ever win half 12 games? Like, it's, what's the point? It's, it's the hope that kills you, isn't it? It's the hope that kills you. You wake up and you're thinking, maybe. You go 1-0 up and you're thinking, just maybe. Remember a half time when I said, would you take a point? And you all said no. Would you take a point? Back to Grealish and that's 4-1. Fuck off! Just, oh lads. It's just pass and move. It's not even complicated. They just pass and move and carve us open. And Alisson should have saved that, by the way. He could have saved it with his foot or his... Yeah, Klopp, you're responsible for this bullshit. Fucking hell. Bunch of... Fu- They're a bunch of cowards. I'm not sorry. I'm sick of this shit. I'm sick of trying to defend the indefensible. They're a bunch of soft fuckers out there who haven't got the ball for a fight. They have let Manchester City absolutely bitch slap us in the second half. And they've rolled over and had their tummies tickled yet again because they haven't got the stomach for it. They haven't got the stomach for it. They should be ashamed to be wearing that shirt. It's a disgrace and anybody who disagrees with me can quite frankly kiss my ass. Because this is horseshit. This is cowardly stuff. It's not even a complicated goal. It's just give and go and follow the runner. That's it. Give the ball, run into the box, get receive the ball back and he finishes it. It's not complicated. They don't even have to work hard. This is training ground stuff. Fucking hell. I want to say one thing very clearly, by the way. I will criticise Jurgen Klopp for this performance. I will criticise the players for this performance. But I still do believe Klopp's the man to put this right. I, I'm in no way moving towards wanting rid of the manager. I'm a long, long, long way from that. But I do want some honest assessment of what we're seeing. A manager needs to... I'm not saying he needs to go full Antonio Conte, but he needs to be fucking honest. And needs to tell us that he sees what we're seeing. Referee puts us out of our misery and blows it up. It finishes Manchester City 4, Liverpool 1. Not many positives to take from that at all. Well done to City on the day. By far the better side, particularly in the second half. Carved us open at will and... Our players looked all too ready to accept their fate and that's what hurts the most about this performance. It's um, it's just another gutless, heartless, soulless, effortless, fightless performance from this group of players who've shown their soft side far too easy this season, far too many times this season. The scoreline in the second half doesn't even flatter City. They put us to the sword and toyed with us.